For uh, most of us, we'd be furious if we were called difficult. So who knows what uh, Home Secretary Theresa May thought when fellow MP Ken Clark used that particular word to describe her earlier in the week. However, one writer today has said, uh, instead of it being an insult, it's actually a badge of honour for her to be called a difficult woman. So what do you think, Janet? Do you agree with that? I don't know why you're starting with me. <laughs> I get called difficult all the time. I think difficult is something you'd never call a bloke. I mean, blokes aren't difficult, are they? They're strong, they're purposeful, they've got opinions, but women are difficult. And when it comes to Theresa May, I think it's fascinating that they're calling her difficult because she's a person who's stuck to her guns, she doesn't shout about what she achieves, she's mm. very firm when she has to be, all qualities that we'd applaud in a man. Yeah. But when um, some bloke like Kenneth Clark, and I choose my words with care as it is daytime television, <laughs> very dishevelled person. That's a very good description. Yeah, a dishevelled man whose brain and mouth were not in gear <laughs> calls someone difficult. I think yeah. that's fantastic. I mean, you obviously, over the years, you're, you're a strong personality and a strong character. Has there been any particular word that you've, you've been called that you thought, do you know what, I'm going to take that and use it as a strength? Well... <laughs> there is. I've got it here, but I think we should... Should we all get oh, our words up? Here we go. Let's show the okay, viewers at home the here. rubbish that we've been called. <laughs> right. There we are. Right. So... We'll start I... with you. Yeah, start with me. Eccentric. <laughs> now, no, Jane and really. I are journalists, so we know that eccentric is journalese for bonkers. When <laughs> 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 we call someone... Eccentric. Yeah. Eccentric means you've got opinions, you don't fit in with the mould, you know what you like, you're not going to compromise, you're an individual. Yeah. So, go with it. Yeah. Clearly, I'm that stupid that I've been in the industry 23 years, created a brand, the breadwinner, and I'm still going strong. Uh, yeah. Millions. Yeah, but I never mention one because that's unattractive. All right. <laughs> but okay, you can add that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> made millions, but it's stupid. Oh, get lost, Janet. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, it's like the Dolly Parton quote, isn't it? I don't mind being called a dumb blonde because oh, I'm, I'm not it. dumb and I'm definitely and not blonde. It's <laughs> is the best thing. The so go on, um, then. Well, this word, I, I've been called this so many times over my life. Not actually funny enough in journalism, um, but definitely in television, in, in you know, by ex-boyfriends, yeah. yeah, on Twitter. Yeah. Because I don't emote, so in circumstances, I will sit back, I'll look at something, I'm quite... Um, impassive in my yeah. expression a lot of the time and people take that as being hard because I'm not sort of crying or you know yeah. flailing laughing about laughing at every mm. I don't varnish myself we're very similar in that I am what I am and I don't sort of particularly you know I'm not all over somebody when I first meet them so people yeah. always go oh she's a bit hard all of my really what well, are now my really good friends always say when we first met you we thought you were really hard and what's and then... interesting is you wouldn't think those two words would be the same but actually they're linked because I get told you know I don't I don't necessarily say very much when I first meet someone I'm, I'm quite quiet in meetings I'm the quietest um, it doesn't mean I don't doesn't mean I don't get it it yeah. just means I'm, I'm thinking or I'm taking it all in and I like to observe yeah. rather than to you know shout and get yeah. involved so, I mean, yeah. Yeah. what I said about the Ken Clark thing it's not so much the word difficult it's the fact that he correlated it with the word woman yeah, yeah. so he, he didn't just say oh yeah Teresa's really difficult yeah, yeah. which is fine woman. it was like she's a difficult woman and yeah. it's the, the sort which of is thing a brilliant thing to be, and it's I think if you've ever been yeah. called it, good for you. More of it! Yeah. Yeah.